Hello and welcome to another indie horror game. This time I'll be playing a game called Seven Nights Ghost, and if you want to spend seven nights with a ghost, the links and the details are of course down below in the description as usual. This is going to be a first person horror experience where I'm going to be going on a business trip. I'm going to have to spend seven days in temporary housing, but the only issue is, this temporary housing is haunted by a ghost. A very mischievous ghost. I really hope you enjoy it. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments, like or dislike the video by the end, alright? Here we go, Seven Nights Ghost. Okay. Interesting way to start. Oh, right. <laughs> It took about three hours from Tokyo by bullet train and local train. I finally arrived here. For the next seven days, I'll live alone in this company housing until the mass production startup at the factory is completed. The note on the company housing should be in the living room. Let's check it first. Alright, I'm in control. Let's see then. Can we leave? We cannot leave. Okay. <laughs> uh, Alright. Looks like we've got our objective in the top left and the options down in the bottom right. Alright. Let's see then. Okay. Oh, good start. Hmm. A little bit dark in here. Is that the is that the light switch? Doesn't seem to be working, unfortunately. Right, so yeah, obviously we can look around, we can move around. And there's something down here. This is it, is it? A note's placed. Perhaps this is a note on company housing. This is Sato from the property management office. Once you've checked in, please check the following. The water's flowing in the kitchen, the lighting beside the bed, and the restroom and in the shower room. If you have any questions, please contact me. Right, it seems I need to check the facilities in this room. It seems this hasn't been used for a long time. I'm sleepy, so let's get it over with. Okay. <laughs> the confirmation of company housing facilities, that's my objective. So we got to check the water and the lights, basically. Okay, I can do that. Right. There you go. Okay. Oh, what's that? Ah, there's a phone. Okay, yeah, it's a smartphone. Sure. Right, okay. Uh, as I informed you in advance, the demolition of this property will start once you've checked out after seven days. If there's something left behind, it'll be discarded. So please be careful. P.S. Welcome to the haunted company housing. You will be the last resident here. Sounds ominous when you read that. Um, <laughs> All right. It's a blue pot. It's a donut I bought at the station. Okay. Yeah, let's eat that later. All right. Okay. So here's my bed. And here's all the cushions and pillows that I can examine. All right. Yeah, let's turn on the light, see if it works. Okay. Good so far. Uh. <laughs> Hold on. The bedside lamp seems fine. Uh, right. Your vision doesn't seem fine, though. Do you maybe need to, like, wipe your eyes or something? What the... Huh. Okay, that was weird. So that's been checked off. Okay. So what we got through here? Alright. A little closet. Man, you can just look at everything in this, can't you? Even stick files of different sizes. Why is there a shovel here or a rusty scoop? What's been going on? <laughs> it's a hanger! Okay. Right, so let's see. Um, through here? Alright. What the hell is that? Is this a robot? Yes, it is. Oh, hang on. There we go. Okay. Well, the lighting seems to work in here. Alright. Oh. 
Bathroom lighting looks fine. Yeah, so far so good. Oh, oh look at the mirror. Look at the mirror. There's a ghost just floating. I guess somewhere behind me. Alright. Well, I think I've noticed it this time. Oh. They're still there. In fact, they might be getting a little bit closer. Hmm. Oh shit. <laughs> hmm. Well, seems like it's all in my head. I don't think it is, but all right, all right, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. We'll um we'll keep our sanity that way. Okay. So, we need to check the water in the kitchen's flowing and the lighting in the restroom, which I guess isn't here. Unless that's the toilet. Uh, alright. Well, here's the kitchen. Uh, here we go. It's a kitchen faucet. Yeah, let's turn on the water. It ran smoothly. The confirmation of water supply is completed. And nothing spooky happened? Good. Okay. Turn off the water. There we go. Right, so... Ooh. Now, why is this stuff here? It's probably there for a reason. I don't know whether to remove it or not. I'm gonna remove it. Ooh. Very interesting. Well, I guess that's going to affect the ghost in some way. Cool. <laughs> okay. Alright. Well, here's the toilet. What we got down here? The paper holder. Is that... I oh! I didn't close that. Oh damn. I, I can't look away. I can't I can't actually move either. Am I locked in? Oh. Oh damn. I don't think I could ignore this. Hi. Sorry, it's occupied. Could you come back later? The good thing about being a ghost, I suppose, you never have to worry about locked doors. Hi. Okay. Right. That's everything then? It looks like that's everything. Holy moly. Right. Yeah, everything seems to be working fine. Uh, apart from me. Oh. What's going on here? What? What was that? Is there a camera set up? I... Okay, the TV is moving by itself. Is it malfunctioning? Hmm. I can't find the remote control. Hmm. Are there no buttons on the television itself? Uh, maybe it's somewhere near the TV. Okay. Well, if it is, I don't see it. Ooh. Right. I'm not imagining this. It looks like I'll better find it soon. Yeah. Okay. Check the TV in the living room. Right, okay. It's a fairly large flat screen TV. Maybe bigger than the one at my home. I think I'm looking for the remote control, aren't I? Oh. Right. You hear that high pitched ringing? The ghost is around, it seems. Hmm. I can't see me in the reflection. Should I be worried? Am I a ghost too? What have we got down here? Oh, hang on. What's that? Is that. Okay. It's an adhesive. Oh. <laughs> Anything else? Okay. Got a, a calculator down there, All right? No remote control. Right. I think I need to keep an eye on you, don't I? Sellotape, tape cutter. It's a cat figurine. I also have three cats at home. Hmm, I guess one of them you were looking at on the way in. Right. Somewhere around here. 
Okay, we've got medicine down here. Yeah, I don't know what medicine it is. Probably best not to touch it. Right, she's getting closer and closer. What have we got here? Ordinary file box. Okay, something down here. Nope. Oh, hang on. Hey, wait, what the... Okay, here's the TV remote control. I'm going to take it. Okay. Just in the nick of time, too, by the sounds of it. I finally got around to turning off the TV. Okay. I think you probably could have just found some buttons on the thing, but... Oh, well. I've done all the checking. I'm going to bed. Good idea. Oh. Oh, it's still playing up. Well, the remote hasn't gone walkies. Maybe you're just better off unplugging it. It seems the TV is malfunctioning already. I'll call the property management office tomorrow. Okay. Oh. Holy shit. She's real. She's very real. Hi. How you doing? Not too good, obviously. You're a ghost. Huh. Oh dear. Yeah, don't take me, take the donut. The donut is a much better option. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> I avoided death because of a donut. I'll take that. I'll take that. Okay. <laughs> It looks like I was let off the hook. Yeah. I need to buy more donuts. They're going to be my lifelines. Okay. Mission accomplished, I suppose. Yeah. So, uh, let's get to bed. And let's move on to the next day. I've got seven days with this woman. Oh. Hang on. This is the main menu, isn't it? What? That can't be it. Come on, load the game. Oh, I see. Right, it's in sections, in chapters. Okay, so, day two. I came home after a day's work. It seems that the rumours about this room are well known, even in the factory. Did you see a ghost? I was asked three times. Yes, I did. Everyone laughed so hard when I replied, I was attacked and robbed of my donut. <laughs> I'd laugh too, in fact I just did. This room is even worse than rumoured, but there's no other place to sleep. I'm trying to stay calm until the last day. Oh. That's not the ghost wanting more donuts, is it? Another extra job. Oh. Go on. What do I need to do in day two, then? Check inventory of supplies. Okay. I can do that. Right. So here we are. Okay, so I need to find the laundry detergent, uh, a band-aid, sellotape, Sellotape? I think I actually saw sellotape. Wait, sellotape's down here, isn't it? There we go. Sellotape and tape cutter. Alright, I got the sellotape. That's one of the three. Wait, ooh, okay, she's back. <laughs> of course she is, I don't think she ever leaves. So, laundry detergent, band-aid. Right, I think... Ooh. Okay, hang on, let me just go check my phone, it's flashing at me. Right, 
I'm sorry it's so late at night. Before the demolition, we'd like to collect some equipments in the room. May I ask you to check the inventory? So it's band-aid, laundry detergent, and sellotape. Thank you for the help. Please take a good rest. Sato. Right, okay. I think I saw medicines down here? Okay. They're just medicine, are they? Ooh. Okay. Playing with headphones, I think, is going to be a benefit, honestly, so I can basically keep my ear out for this high-pitched ringing. <laughs> All right. Right, what? This is a stag beetle? Apparently. Hold it. Ah, hold on. A band-aid. There we go. I got the band-aid. Oh. Okay. Yeah, this does strike me as odd. This is... It's a well-made stag beetle toy. Did the previous occupant leave it behind? Well, I guess. I didn't bring it with me. Okay, I've got the stag beetle toy. <laughs> I don't think I really needed that, but... Oh well, I'm going above and beyond. So it's just the laundry detergent that I need to find now. Right. So that was that. What's this? A typical lighter. Candle stand. You can pretty much examine everything, can't you? Oh, I hear her. But I don't see her. Is she using the loo? Well, she didn't give me privacy. I'm not going to give her any. Okay. What's this? Toilet cleaner! <laughs> whoa! Whoa! Okay. Maybe I should have given her some privacy. I couldn't find the supplies. I was still looking. <laughs> I didn't know. Was there a time limit? Maybe there was a time limit. Or maybe that was just an area I should have avoided because she was using it. Okay, let's try this again. Right. It doesn't seem like she's here now. That's toilet cleaner. That's the paper holder. We've got some soap. But that's about it, it seems. Right. Down here? Okay, we've got some tools. There's some pliers. And there's a wrench. Not exactly what we're after, though, is it? Oh, okay. So she's over there. I'm going to stay away from that area, if possible. In here, maybe? Oh, there's another one. Why is this stuff here? I removed the first one, so... Yeah, okay, I'm going to stick with this. If I find them, I'll remove them. Okay, these are just empty bottles, nothing inside there. There's the washing machine. Is that more soap? Yeah, okay. Oh, hang on. She's around there somewhere. <laughs> I think it's probably best you stay away from the area that you last heard her in. Got some bleach, bath detergent. Okay. This might be it. Laundry detergent. There we go. Now I've made sure all the supplies are in the inventory. Now I just need to call Masato before I forget. I'm pretty sure I left my phone on the table in the living room. Where I last heard her. Right. Let's see if I can get to it unscathed. Okay. Alright. I've contacted Masato. Brilliant. Anything else that you need to do? Tomorrow will be early too, so... Oh. Okay. Oh, this is... this is bait. This is bait. Don't go any closer. Oh, alright. <laughs> There's no one there. Hmm. Oh. Hello. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what the hell was all that about? Oh. The beat was on the floor. That toy. Hi. Oh, not this again. You're not going to give me the touch of death, are you? What? Has she, has she noticed the beetle? Was that her toy? I don't have a donut. Maybe I should give that to her. Oh! <laughs> 
Oh, or maybe she's scared of it. Okay. Yeah, maybe she's scared of it. She's gone. All right. Oh. Oh, yeah. Shaking like a leaf. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's not real. But you know what? If it's going to stop you from killing me, it's very real. Um, that's, that's a toy. <laughs> oh, she going to try and crush it? Yeah, as I said, it's a toy. Nothing to be scared of. Are you something I should be scared of? <laughs> yes, she looks extremely angry. And she's gone. Okay, all right. Yeah, less beetles, more donuts. That's what I'm taking from this. Yeah, she's not very good with bugs. Apparently not, no. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Again, mission accomplished. Okay, we've got through the first day and day two. Bring on day three, I suppose. So is it going to... Yeah, it takes me back to the menu again. Interesting game so far, yeah. There's a, there's a little bit of comedy to it. It's, um, it is kind of spooky, but it is kind of funny. It's actually reminding me of a game I played well, a year or two ago now, I suppose, called Hatch. It's got those kind of vibes. But there we go. Okay, day three. Let's see what happens on day three. Please tell me I've got a big surplus of donuts with me. Hmm? Oh. Hmm! Wait, this is... What is that? Whatever it is, it's empty. Oh. I knew it had gone. Pudding I bought yesterday is gone. What, because the ghost ate it? There's only one person who could have done this. <laughs> okay. It's her. She did it. Oh, we can't have that. Oh, you did have a donut. Okay. If that were true, this donut I bought today is targeted too. Very true. Nothing's safe. I have to hide it somehow. Okay. <laughs> And how do you plan on doing that? I think she knows this place better than you do. Okay, our objective for day three is to hide the donuts. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Uh, I need to find a food storage container and a container lid. Okay. A cup of pudding that she finished eating. How cruel. Okay. Uh, All right, so let's see. We've got frying pans down here, a deep frying pan. Okay. Oh, here we go, an empty food storage container. Yes! Okay. Well, that's one half of it. I just need to find the lid. We got some chopsticks down here by the looks of it. Maybe down here. Uh, saucepan lid and a saucepan. Okay. A big saucepan and another one. Uh, we got some tea bags. A ladle. Knives. Hmm. Nothing in there? No? Okay. Ah. Okay, where the hell is the lid? Oh, it, it, do you know where the lid is? <laughs> she probably does, doesn't she? Okay, so there's some cupboards up here. Let's see. Empty bottles? Lots of empty bottles. Yeah, not many lids. <laughs> Alright. Oh, and up here too. Okay. Platters. A platter with an unusual design. Plates. Yeah, just plates. Right, she's over here. Maybe she's, you know, protecting it. And there's my phone. This is Ito from Development Section 1. Thanks for your business trip. How's life at the Haunted Company housing? Did you meet the rumoured ghost? Kidding aside, so don't worry about it too much. Some rumours have been going around for a few years that the TV turns on by itself, or that the snacks seem to be vanishing. But I think people were just imagining things. Take care of yourself so you don't get tired and have weird visions. Ito. 
Okay, <laughs> I'll try. I'm not seeing anything here. Oh, I am seeing the ghost pop up though. Nothing over here in this corner. Hmm. Really not sure. Nothing underneath the bed. Oh god, look, there's another one. Oh, <laughs> careful. There's another one of these though. Remove it, yeah. I've removed the previous two, so there you go. In here? I don't remember seeing a lid. There's some other tools. A draw knife, a saw, a ghost. I don't know if it's around here. But where would it be if not the kitchen or, or there? It wouldn't be around the toilet, would it? Or, or down here? I guess she's hidden it somewhere. Because she's mischievous. Stay away, alright? I can't see you, but stay away. There's no cupboards down there. Oh, I can- oh, I can have a look at the toilet lid, but I can't have a look down the toilet. <sighs> what if it's there? I want to be thorough. <laughs> okay, there's that little robot toy again. Nothing down there in these baskets? No. Yeah, that's a towel. And that's the washing machine. What's this? Oh, that's it! That's it! Why is it here? Okay, I'm going to take it. Okay, brilliant. Now I've got a container to put the donut in. But I just want to clean the container before putting it in. Is there any way to clean it? Well, I mean, yeah. Maybe not there, but... What the fuck? <laughs> sometimes you can see her, sometimes you can only hear her. I'm just waiting for her to appear again, honestly. Maybe some of this stuff? Dish soap? Okay. Yes! Oh, okay. Alright, we're using the sponge. We're gonna wash this off. I've scrapped the food storage container clean. Now we just need to hide the donuts when she's not looking. I'm gonna need something to attract her attention. Right, okay. I Whoa. Wow, she was close. Very close. <laughs> Let me just get out of your area, okay? Uh, so I need something to attract her attention. I, I need to find items to in induce her. That's a strange way of putting it, but okay. Maybe I can turn the TV on or something, or...? Hmm. No. Nah, this wouldn't work, would it? Faux greenery? The alarm clock? Oh, I can take the alarm clock! Okay. Okay, let's use this to lure her in. First, use this to lure her to the restroom. And while she's going to the restroom, I'll hide the donuts in the closet. Let's hope I didn't say that out loud. <laughs> right, that's actually where I'm hearing the high-pitched noise. So I might just hang here for a bit. Uh, oh, okay, I'm gonna go through you. And everything's okay, is it? Okay, brilliant, right, so how... Uh, how do I... How do I do this? Ah, that's why I can use the lid, so I place the alarm clock on the lid. Right, okay, so I set my alarm clock for one minute. Good. One minute, right. So that's going to ring in one minute. Uh, I've just got to wait, I suppose. I've just got to try and survive, try and not get caught. Or let my donuts get caught, really. Alright. I love the interactivity in this game. You can virtually interact with everything. Okay, she's somewhere around here, so I'm going to be over here where I, I think I'm going to be hiding the donuts, right? I think I just need to wait for my cue. Alright. There's no timer. I don't actually know if this clock works. Doesn't seem like it does, does it? Oh. <laughs> Alright. A few more seconds, maybe? Hopefully I'm going to hear it. All right. Everything... Oh! There we go! All right. So, I don't know where she is, but she's probably somewhere over there, so... I need to go in here and dump the donuts, that's right. Now the donut is safe. <laughs> I bought that donut for breakfast before I go to work tomorrow. 
And we wouldn't want anything happening to it, would we? I won't let my modest enjoyment during the business trip be taken away any further. Uh <laughs> She's got the donut. She saw, of course she saw. You're hardly subtle. Oh, jeez. That... Oh, no way! <laughs> After all that effort. <laughs> please. Please return it. No, I don't think she's going to do it. Ah. Oh. She's running away with the do Oh, donut. Oh. Oh, maybe she is going to give it back. I don't know. Maybe she just wanted a bite. Well, she's taunting me with it. She's fucking taunting me with it! Oh my god. She's infuriating. <laughs> right. I think next time you get a donut, you eat it outside of this place. All is lost, he says. All is lost. A bit dramatic. Oh, very dramatic, considering that another mission's been accomplished. <laughs> okay, uh, we can move on to day four then, I suppose. This is a silly little game, but I'm enjoying it. Alright. Alright, day four. Oh? Cup noodles? I put hot water in the instant noodle. Alright. Eating instant noodles at midnight is so unhealthy. But I'm so tired today. Let's just eat whatever I want and go to bed. Okay. I can't find chopsticks. I did think something was missing in that drawer. Yeah. That's strange. They were here yesterday. They were. No way. She hid that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think she did. No kidding. The noodles will get soggy. Well, maybe you should have found the chopsticks before you put the water in. Just a thought. Right. So, what? We need to... We need to find the chopsticks? Not exactly, no. We need to find substitutes for chopsticks. Okay. Oh, and we actually have a timer this time. There's, okay, there's five minutes, right. That's not good. Um, so where has she hidden them? They used to be here. Can we use a ladle? No? Can we use two knives? No, that's not going to work, is it? Okay, we, we're going to have to look everywhere. In the... Ooh, in the strangest places, potentially. Shit, okay. In here? No? Empty bottle. This weapon could replace chopsticks. Y yeah? Okay, that saber that he's got? That's- okay, that's substitute A for the chopstick. Right, there's also substitute B that we need to find. Okay, let's look for substitute B. Uh, a sponge? No. Okay, but I guess something- Something kind of thin? Something we can hold in one hand, something kind of thin. You know what I'm thinking, actually? Back here. Back here. I saw loads of... I saw loads of files. Hang on. Oh. Oh. Right, I'm just trying to read this on my phone, okay? This is Yokoyama. Thanks for your hard work. I heard from Ito that you're on a business trip to the haunted company housing. It's a property with many rumours, but I'm sure you'll be fine with it. Your family's home is a temple. I think the ghost owes you a favour, too. I think it's cold there, so please do your best not to catch a cold. Right. Yes, is Nina doing well? Right. I think the ghost owes you a favour. She owes me a favour? Strange. Right, before I was sidetracked with the phone, I was going to have a look in here, actually. Right, yeah. We've got a couple of stick files here. And then there's- okay, there's this one. Yeah. Oh, really? I thought that was going to be it. There's a hand drill, draw knife, saw. There's another one of these as well. I'm going to remove it. Now I've started, so I'll finish. Right. 
<laughs> okay, it's not here, obviously. Uh, let's look in here. Okay, can't use the pliers. I can't use the wrench, remarkably. That's not it. Hand soap, no. No. I'm not going to be using the faux greenery. Ah, uh, jeez. Uh, oh, what do I do? What do I do? Where the hell are these chopsticks? There's not another little robot toy, is there? That'd be nice. Something up here? Nah, just a load of empty bottles. And then there's the platters and the plates. That's not going to be good enough. Okay, it's, it's going to have to be something in here. Stay right where you are, okay? Uh... No... No, I don't think so. Oh, okay, yep, she's getting kind of close. Maybe something over here? Uh... The lighter? No, <laughs> I don't think that's going to work. Uh, down here? There's nothing down there, is there? The medicine... What is it? What do I need to use? It's not the TV remote control, is it? That wouldn't make any sense. I've got about two minutes to figure this out, though. That's the problem. I feel like I've looked at everything, you know? But maybe I haven't? Maybe there's going to be something hidden in one of the vases, or... I don't know. Can't have a look at that, no. Nothing behind the door. Right. There was definitely nothing back here. It's definitely not one of these files. Nothing hidden down there. No. The hanger. <laughs> okay, maybe it could replace chopsticks if it's crafted. Y yeah? That's the substitute? It looks like it's made of wire. I think it could be used for chopsticks if I cut it. Let me find a tool so I can cut the wire. Right, the saw? Right, okay. Any of these files? Wait, we've got a few more tools over here, haven't we? There's the wrench and... Uh, oh, the, the pliers? Yes! Process the hangers, that's right! <laughs> this seems a little bit unnecessary, honestly. But I cut the hanger to the right length. Okay. So we found our substitutes? I guess so. I finally finished eating them using impromptu chopsticks. <laughs> I hope I won't get a stomach ache later. Me too. Oh. Hello? Is that someone at the front door? Or a certain ghost? Oh, the chopsticks. Pencils? Forks and spoons as well. I've got my chopsticks and fork back now. She's like a child, isn't she? <laughs> that girl, she's just messing with me. Oh. oh. Uh, okay. You want to watch TV? I'll let you watch TV. I'm sorry, I know you're trying to dick around with me, but... I'm staying, alright? At least for the next couple of days. I've got nowhere else to go, so you're just going to have to learn to put up with me. Alright. Okay, uh, can I ask you a question? What? Yeah, why don't you go to heaven? What's keeping you here? What's going on? Oh. Well, maybe she just did. <laughs> just like that. She's like, yeah, why am I here? Huh. Well, I guess we're not going to get our answer, are we? <laughs> I can't believe I used the hanger as a chopstick. That's ridiculous. Oh! Uh, okay. What was that? It's a post-it note. I always wanted to live with a good-looking man. Oh. Right. And so your wish is coming true? Oh, by the way, you're not good-looking. Oh, shit. Okay. So she's waiting for someone better to come along? 
Well, this place is due to be demolished, so I don't think that's going to happen. I see, I say, disappointingly. Oof. That's a bit of a blow to the ego. <laughs> Nevertheless, another mission accomplished. Okay. Moving on to day five now. What? Oh? What is it? It's from the direction of the TV. Okay. Oh. What was this? Oh. That... Oh, that cat statue. Oh, it's broken. It's the cat figurine displayed beside the TV. Hmm. Why does she want to break it? Did she drop it? Its tail's broken off. Hmm. Oh. Oh dear. It looks like she's in shock. And so she's going to take it all out on me, right? Okay. Our mission today is repair the cat figurine. There's various tools and, you know, like sellotape. Um, I think I saw glue around here somewhere. Let's see. What do I need? Oh, damn. Okay, first things first. I think I need a light source. What's going on down here? This is Ito from Development Section 1. I read your email, but was that serious? You asked me to check if anyone actually died in that company housing. Did you really see a ghost? That's just a rumor. Don't take it seriously. Even if there is a ghost, that room will be demolished in three days, right? Then the ghost will go away, I think. Well, I can ask some senior employees a little bit about it, but don't rely on me too much. All right, well, the ghost is very real. As is that flashlight. Hold on. I'm going to want that. It's a pocket light with a clip. Yeah, of course I'm going to take it. Conveniently, there's a light on here. Yes, conveniently. This feels like another trap. This feels like bait again. Go on. Ah, there you go. <laughs> She's hiding under the bed. That's not going to stop me. I really do want that light source. I've got it. And I didn't get my fingers nibbled off. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's a silly little game, but it can still scare me from time to time. I was surprised. Yeah, me too. Me too. Okay, but now that I've got that, what do we need to do? We need to find adhesive A and adhesive B. Okay, in the dark. I do remember finding some adhesive. Over here, I think. Where was it? Was it? Oh no, hang on. It's here, isn't it? Yeah, fast drying adhesive. Yes, okay. Okay, so that's adhesive A. So there's another one? I don't remember seeing another one in all my travels around the room. I don't remember seeing another one. So, hold on. Ah, no, it doesn't work. I've got to keep the lights off. I guess she's got something to do with that. Right, okay. Um, down here? No, this is just like medicine and stuff, isn't it? Yeah. That's the lighter. There's nothing down there. It seems like, for the most part, things don't really move around. Unless, you know, she's moved them around. She's trying to hide something from me. <sighs> Stay right where you are, okay? Maybe the adhesive would be in here. Okay, that's empty. Oh, the hanger's back! I got a replacement, apparently. <laughs> right. Somewhere over here? No, I don't think there's any adhesive here. Could be... could be somewhere through here. Oh, stay, stay. 
This is just a mirror, isn't it? It's not really a cabinet or a cupboard or anything like that. Stay. Bleach. They're both bleach. Detergent. Oh, bloody hell. Okay, I'm getting out of this area. It's got to be something somewhere, but where? Right, here we go. Uh, no, that's a USB hub. There isn't anything on the other side though, is there? Right. Could you just leave me alone? I'm actually trying to do you a favour, but you keep on sneaking up on me. I'm also, of course, half looking out for the, uh, you know, like, the talisman, the seal that I keep seeing. There seems to be one each day. Oh, there it is. It's there. Alright. Remove it. Yes. Drum washing machine. Holy shit. Okay. Yes. That was very well hidden. Okay, I've got both A and B glue mixtures. Now I should be able to repair the damaged part. Okay, I just need a file or something for molding. I hope I can find it somewhere. Right, the th oh, the the files. I know where the files are. The files are around here. Okay. So stick file not suitable. Okay. Ah, she must be in there somewhere. What about this one? This thin one. Seems thin and easy to handle. Yeah, I got a stick file. Okay. All right, we're gonna fix this. Uh, the glue got the tail to stick. Good stuff. Now all I have to do is file away the glue that's sticking out and clean it up. So no one will ever know. All right. Oh. Oh, okay. Right. Ah, uh, we've only got the two things to do, but we can't do them at the same time. I can look around, and I can repair. I can file. But I can't file and look around at the same time. I guess she's going to be lurking around in the darkness. Am I going to hear her? Oh, Hi! <laughs> right. Could you file any slower? Come on. Twenty percent. Oh, 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 oh! Wow. Yeah, she's getting a little bit too close for comfort, honestly. Oh bloody hell! I can barely turn around and see her there, but she was there. Twenty-five percent. Oh, ah, ah, ah. Okay, continue, continue. Ah, ah, ah. Stay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Stay right where you are. She wants to sneak up on me from behind. It's becoming predictable. Oh, that was close. That was really close. Why can't I move and do this? Why can't I look around and do this? It doesn't make sense. Okay, she's over there. She's actually quite a distance away. Continue. Come on. We're nearly halfway. <laughs> she always looks so glum, you know? Like she's not too bothered. Okay, 50%. Oh. Alright. Come on, we're in the final 50 now. We can do this. Oh, 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 she's, she's approaching from the bed now. She's changing up her tactic. I keep doing the same part of the tail. This bit looks great. What about the rest of it? Oh, Jesus. Okay, right. <laughs> this is actually quite fun. Okay, two thirds done. Oh, oh, okay, right. Come on. Let's get to 70. Yep. All right, three quarters done. Ah, okay, all right. I'm not concerned with her, you know, killing me or anything like that, but I do think if I'm caught, she is going to steal a donut. So, yeah. 
That's why I'm paying very, very close attention as I do this. We're nearly there. The last 10% now. Okay, come on. 90? 90. 91. 92. Okay. I thought this caused her distress. She was in shock, right? I'm, I'm doing you a favor, all right? Just let me finish this off. Come on. 99. 100! Okay, I've repaired the cat's tail. The repair is complete. Now, please, don't drop it again, okay? <laughs> Put it back in its container. I think it's stuck beautifully. It does look pretty good. Good as new, yeah. Oh shit. You might want to look up. Or not. There's no one there. Or is there? Hmm. Oh, wow. Wow, okay. <laughs> uh, you'd have definitely caught me if you did that while I was filing away. Holy moly. Oh, bloody hell. Is this your way of thanking me for doing a good job? What are you doing? I, no, no, we've been through this! Have I got a donut ready? Oh boy. Ooh. No, I don't think I do this time. But I do have a cat figurine! Yeah, look at this! Look! Good as new! I repaired it because it looked repairable. And as it turns out, it was. I'm sorry. Was it unnecessary? Yeah, she didn't want it to be broken, right? Uh, okay. Well, the lights are back on. She was very happy. Well, I don't know about very happy, but she didn't kill me, so that's always a plus. There you go, another mission accomplished. I think there's only two more days now. Alright, here we are, the penultimate day. Day six. What's she got in store for me this time? The life here is nearly over. Yes, it is. I was surprised to meet a roommate, but I've learned a lot about how to deal with her. <laughs> yeah, I suppose so. Oh, looks like your phone's going. However, according to the schedule, this room is scheduled to be demolished after two days. Yeah, her along with it, presumably. I'm a little concerned about what will happen to her after the demolition. Hmm. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Hello? Uh, hi. What's this? Okay. Uh, key? There's a key on the post-it note. She's written me another note by the looks of it. Yeah, I can't really discern what that says, unfortunately. She's up to mischief again. Yes, she is. Oh, with the lights off. Okay, our mission objective this time. Find time of rest. Time of rest. Okay, thankfully I've still got the flashlight. Right, okay. So, there's a sticky note on the table. And something's painted on it. Okay, I got the sticky note with a key drawn. Brilliant. And this is a message from her. Okay. Unless you solve all the riddles, you'll be stuck in this room forever. By the light box, grid lines indicate the keyhole. Follow the numbers and crush the squares. From the mouth of the white porcelain emerging in a cloud of white smoke, a signpost pointing to the key. 
the key unlocks the door of impurity. The pair of sake cups show where it is. When the sake cups are set on the table, the world will regain its light and warmth, and people will find the time to rest. Right. The light box. The mouth of the white porcelain. The toilet? Okay. Um... Yeah, okay. Right, I'm just gonna leave that there. Oh, okay, I'm not taking that with me. So what could she be talking about exactly? Would this be the light box? Maybe she doesn't know what it is. Oh, hang on, this wasn't here before, was it? Strange papers pasted. Okay, let's check it. All right. And see then. Uh. <laughs> okay, a little bit like last time. We can uh, we can have a little look around, watch our back as we're doing this, as we're sorting all this out. Oh man, I don't. I don't know. Was it five by seven? Five by seven. So there's thirty-five squares, and then we can choose which ones are coloured in. Is that going to be the top right corner? I hope it's the top right corner. I hope none of these need to be rotated either. Ah! <laughs> Caught ya! Caught ya! So... These two? Um... Yeah, okay. Stay! Stay! I'm trying to figure this out, okay? Like that. We are creating some sort of pattern. It's not going to be a heart or something, is it? Like... Nah, surely not. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Alright, okay. So, I sorted these two out. That would have to be the... Hmm. If that's in the bottom left, then... Uh, 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 uh. If that's the bottom left, then that's the one. And then that would go there. Would oh, 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 okay. Would that go there? Oh no, that's there, isn't it? So it would get ah, yes, okay. We've we've located the keyhole. I I guess. Uh, what is this illustration? Fountain? I think I saw it in the restroom. Right, well that would make sense, because uh, I think white porcelain was mentioned. I think that would be the toilet, right? Hold on though, hold on. This is Yokoyama. Thank you for telling me about Nina. I'm very sorry that I suddenly made an unreasonable request to you five years ago when you just joined the company, but I still think it was the right thing to ask you. Thank you very much. It's already been five years since you joined the company. The time flies by so fast, doesn't it? Please give my regards to your family. Alright, thanks. A reasonable request five years ago. Strange. Very strange. Okay. Hi there. <laughs> Let's read this again. So the light box, the grid lines, we've done all that. The mouth of the white porcelain emerging in a cloud of white smoke. A signpost pointing to the key. Right. Something to do with this. Fountain? Yeah. Okay. All right. Whoa, 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 that was close, that was really close. Okay, in here. Paper holder. Oh, hello! <laughs> Why is this here? Remove it, okay. Keep finding these things. I don't actually understand. Oh, oh! I can use these buttons individually? Ah, there it is, that second one. That's it, that's the symbol. Did that do something? I don't know. Did that do something? Right. We can't have a look at the lid this time. We can't lift this up or anything. No, oh, oh, okay, alright. That's it though, right? 
We can hit all these buttons. But I think it's that one that we want to hit, but... I don't know, did that change anything? I might need to go and look at the note again. From the mouth of the white porcelain emerging in a cloud of white smoke, a signpost pointing to the key. Right, the key unlocks the door of impurity. The pair of sake cups show where it is. Have we ever seen any sake cups? I don't think so. Right. Item list? Okay, oh, here we go. So this is what I picked up. That was the sticky note. So the key is pointing to the left. Uh, I don't really understand, I have to admit. No, okay. White porcelain. I guess it could be something to do with the bath or one of the sinks, maybe? I don't really know what she's getting at. Maybe, you know, maybe it's not the toilet, but then that's where that symbol is. Okay, do we need to run a bath? Hmm. Wait, hang on, look at these. An ordinary file box. They didn't have the numbers on them before, right? 2 times 3 minus 75? What the hell is this? I can't do anything with them, though. That was not like that before. That was not like that before at all. There's got to be a reason that looks different. Okay. Uh, yes? Oh. Oh! Is this porcelain? Right, so maybe I needed to... Moisten the stickies with steam. Yes? Oh, shit, right. I, okay, I was barking up the wrong tree. I was really barking up the wrong tree. I thought it might be the toilet, or if not the toilet, the bar. Oh. Hi. <laughs> oh, hot. Yeah, keep your hand away, even though it probably won't affect you. Okay, so wait, that was the key? I've located the key. I've located the key, but I haven't found the key. Oh, look at that. Right, now it's a damp sticky note with a key drawn. The key is... Was that like a hob or something? Hang on, we might be... It... Stay there. That wasn't one of the buttons on the thing, was it? I don't think so. Oh shit, hello. <laughs> There's that. That's not it, though. Why can I hit all four of these? Right. I was certain it was going to be like a button for a hob, because that's what it reminds me of, but maybe not. We can't do anything more with this? Okay. Is it something to do with... Is it something to do with hot water? Because that looks like steam to me, you know? Right, hold on. I'm going to have a look at the riddle again. So, from the mouth of the white porcelain emerging... A right, so that's the kettle. That's the signpost pointing to the key. The key unlocks the door of impurity. The pair of sake cups shows where it is. That I don't understand. That I really don't understand. Right. We're going to try all the sinks, I think. Okay. I can't use this faucet. Uh, maybe in here, where she is. <laughs> Definitely can't use this one. Definitely can't use this one. Could you leave, please? Because I want to go to that sink, and I don't want you to catch me. <laughs> oh, there she is. Okay, good, good. Right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, you can't trust that. She could just sneak up on you from anywhere, at any time. <sighs> okay, in here, though. No. Shower head, can't use that. <sighs> come on, come on. A signpost pointing to the key. 
So whatever this thing is, whatever the symbol means, that's the signpost that points to the key. So it's not the hob, it's not like hot water or anything. What could it be? Plus, you know, if the, if the key was in a sink, I'd have found it by now, right? But I was wondering if maybe, you know, I, it would be shown up in the steam or something when I, I turned the hot water on. That's what I was trying to do. Oh, hang on. Maybe it was the shower head and it's pointing me towards this. Another sticky note, right. Something's painted on it, right. Take this, yes. Okay, so let's have a look at this. Okay, so this is the key. This is the key. Next I can locate a pair of sake cups with, with this, apparently. So square to lines to F to TV to F to, s to square. <sighs> okay. TV presumably doesn't mean TV, because she doesn't know what a TV is. She called it like a light box or something, right? So maybe that stands for something else? I don't know what F stands for. Those fucking buttons, right? Down here. That could very easily be the square one. And that could be the one that could be the one that looks like the, the three lines. So Maybe that's why we can hit all the buttons, because we're meant to be hitting we're meant to be hitting them in a sequence of six. F T V F Oh. Which one's F, which one's TV? That was found by the TV, so maybe that's TV. F, TV, F... Square? Was that it? Ah, that was- Oh, that's it! It was all to open the toilet! That was the door of impurity or whatever. Hold on, hold on, we've got another one. I quite like this game, actually. Okay, something to do with 39. It's the folders, isn't it? Yeah, 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 okay, so 39, right, let's go take another look at that. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. Ah, right, now we can sort some stuff out. So 2 times 3, yeah, 2 times 375 minus, that's not gonna work, is it? Whoa, okay. All right, we're gonna have to do some quick maths. How do we make, was it 39? 39. 39. Okay, so we click and then it moves them around. 2 times 3 minus 75. No, I don't think so. And if we uh, change that around, that's not going to make too much sense either. 2 times 7 would be 14. 53. Right, 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 right. Okay, hold on, hold on. We're going to have to make 53, I think, to begin with. 53 minus 2 times 7. That's it. That's it. That's 39. Okay. Okay, it's a... Oh, it's a cat-shaped mug. Yeah. That's the sake cup? I guess so. And then what do I need to do with them? Just place them down. That's it. <laughs> Is this a sake cup? Uh, sort of, yeah. What's going to happen now? Well, I don't know. Maybe she's going to appear with party poppers or... Oh, she's, she's fallen down again. You're still going to take the bait? She's just going to want to jump you. Oh, and she did. She did. <laughs> okay. So that's my reward for doing this? Oh. Well, I'm still alive. She doesn't want to kill me, does she? I think she quite likes me, to be honest. She probably quite likes the company. Oh. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. Yeah, take a seat. Take a seat right over there. Looks like she sorted out some coffee for you. Oh no, that's the tea, isn't it? Yeah, those two tea bags that were in the drawer. Strange. Very strange. Can I have it? Yeah? 
It, uh, what does that mean? Ah, is that your way of saying thank you? Oh, for the cat? Right. You could just say thank you. Those were your last two. Oh, thank you so much for this. Right. She hasn't poisoned it, has she? Maybe that's her end game. She wants to kill me so I can be a ghost with her. That was almost a smile, wasn't it? The tea she made was heartwarming. Okay. Tomorrow would be my last night in this room. Hmm. And how are you feeling about that? Are you going to miss her? Because I think she's going to miss you. There we go. Another mission accomplished. There's only one more day. And here it is. Day seven. What's it going to be? Oh. I <laughs> she's in a bad mood, evidently. Yeah, throwing things around. She's been like this since I got back. She keeps taking it out on the furniture. But not me, thankfully. Okay. I'm sure she knows that tomorrow this room will be demolished. Yeah. But my guess is that she probably... Oh. Oh, that's my phone. She probably what? What was that? I... There's something I really need to tell her. Oh, there goes the robot. <laughs> anyway, I need her to calm down for once. Oh, we're lacking battery. The battery has run out of charge. Okay. So, do I need to charge my phone? Maybe that's it. Not exactly, no. I need to... I need to tell the truth. The truth. What truth? Okay. Well, there's my phone. Confirm the contents? It's only got 1%, but sure. Now, this is Ito from Development Section 1. Thanks for your business trip. People have been reluctant to talk about the person who died at that company housing, but I finally found out what happened. It seems that a woman named Madoka Sawaizi passed away five years ago. I don't know the cause of death, but it seems like she died in the room where she stayed during her business trip. If Sawaizi's ghost really existed in that room... I'm getting scared. I'll stay out of it, Ito. That's who she is? She passed away five years ago. That's when I joined the company, wasn't it? Right. All I need to do is keep escaping until the charge is complete, it seems. Right. So, uh, we've just got to wait this out. Right. Let's see. Where oh, there she is. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like standing here is probably quite good. I know there's a few areas she can approach me from, but I don't know if she ever spawns right where I am. Right, there we go. There's my cue to skedaddle and leave. Let's get the doors open as well so I can see her coming. Okay. She's... Oh, she was there, I think. Oh, another one! Another one! Oh, okay. I feel like maybe if I'm doing that, I'm making it harder on myself. Or easier on myself? I don't know. Right. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. I think I had the right idea. Standing about here. Alright. That way I can very easily nip over and check my phone, of course, once it's done. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm just going to keep on rotating, because this does seem to be working. Oh. Oh, ah, 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 ah. Okay. Right. Uh-huh. Right. Has she calmed down? She was a bit aggressive there. Honestly, I'm only trying to help. 
And hopefully I am. Right. I have to admit, I do quite like her, but I don't like her enough to, uh, you know, want to spend eternity with her in death. I don't want her to kill me. Right. Okay, nearly at 50%. This reminds me of filing away at that figurine. Only this time I can move around. Whew. It's a very interesting take on a, on a horror game like this, isn't it? But it can be scary. But uh, yeah, at times it it has been kind of heartwarming as well, as I was promised. Bloody hell! All right. Oh. Come on. Come on. Okay. Nearly at 60. 60%, 40 to go. Oh, shit. Oh, that was close. That was close. Wow. Okay. She didn't she didn't want to stop. Usually she's got a pretty good reaction time, you know. You spot her and then she goes away. Not anymore, it seems. She's sticking around. Okay, she's in there somewhere. If she can get stuck, that'd be great. 70%, 70%. There she is. Stay there, okay? Go and use the restroom. Lock yourself in the toilet. I won't bother you, and hopefully you won't bother me. Maybe this is the best way to deal with this at this point. Stay, yeah. Okay. I feel like she's going to bring out the big guns. Oh, yeah. She's she's definitely getting aggressive, and she's not going away. Oh, go away, go away. Get, ooh, man. Yeah, she's staying an extra, like, split second or so than usual. And she's getting ever so closer. I think she might be traveling a little faster as well. Man, okay, this is, yeah, this is harsh. Come on, come on. Ooh, okay. We're in that final 10% now. 90. There we go. Is she in there? Okay, she was. 91. 92. Oh, I'm just turning around so erratically now. Ooh, oh, 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 oh. Stay, stay. Come on. Come on. We're nearly there. My phone's nearly charged. Does it need to be 100%? Well, it is. 100%. Wow, okay. Yeah, that was that was actually quite tough. <laughs> All right, yeah. I'm uh, I'm panting because I've been spinning around so much. Finally, the charge is done. Oh. she angry again? Oh, she's something. Oh, God. Oh, okay. Well, my seven days are up, and so is my time. That's not funny. Okay. Again? I'm not dead. She didn't do it? She didn't do it because she doesn't want to do it. Hmm. Oh? <laughs> you making room for me, or...? As you probably know... Go on. This room will be demolished tomorrow. I probably won't see you again. So, now I have something very important to tell you. What? Are you going to confess your love to her or something? You're Madoka Sawa Easy, right? Hmm. 
you worked for the same company as I do, and stayed here at the company housing as well. And died in this room five years ago. Right. How'd that happen, by the way? Was she murdered? She's got... She's got something on her cheeks. Poison, maybe? I don't know. And this is my prediction. The reason you haven't gone to heaven is not because you're not shacking up with good-looking men. <laughs> as much as I'd love to believe it, it's because you have some other regret. Some unresolved issue in your life. Do you recognize it? Recognize what? The cat? That's the photo that I was looking at at the beginning. Oh, that's Nina! Right, her name's Nina, and I got her from Mr. Yokoyama five years ago. Huh. Right. Okay. You were Nina's original owner, weren't you? Funny that. After you passed away, Nina had nowhere else to go, and was taken in by Mr. Yokoyama. But he couldn't take care of her for long. His daughter was found to be allergic to cats. And she was transferred to me, right? And then I, who had joined the company at the right time, was given the opportunity. And I took it. Because I had already taken care of several cats at my family's temple. Right. <laughs> she doesn't know what a TV is, but she seems to be working her way through that smartphone pretty well. Ah, oh, Nina passed away two weeks ago. Oh, that's a shame. She had an enlarged thyroid gland. It's a disease that affects a lot of older cats. Ah. Oh. She passed away peacefully in her sleep, surrounded by other cats. Not a bad way to go, I suppose. So you're both dead. She had a sweet tooth, just like you. She often nibbled on the Japanese sweets I left in the living room. Nina was mourned with great care at my parents' house. Wow, okay. I didn't expect that sort of connection. But I suppose now it makes sense. It all makes sense. Yeah, mission accomplished. So that's it, is it? That's how the game finishes? Uh, okay. Surely there's got to be more. There has to be more. There has to be a proper ending. Ah, there is. Okay, day eight afternoon. There's a day eight, all right. All right. So is this pre-demolition? Oh, okay. Looks a little bit different now, doesn't it? A staff from the property management office and a junk dealer came and disposed of all the household goods. Right. I really don't have a problem going home now, but I kind of helped them finish up. Hmm. Well, there's another one of those seals on the door. Where's she? Oh, she hasn't been seen since last night. Well, time to go. Looks like I'm taking the cat figurine with me. Hmm? Oh? What's up? Did you notice something? I didn't. <laughs> oh. 
All right. Seems like a lovely view. She did it, finally. What did she do? What are you talking about? What did she do? <laughs> well, maybe she's gone, right? Check out from the room. That's all I need to do. Check out from the room. We need to finish this off. Right. So, oh, I need to find the house key, the bullet train ticket, and the smartphone. Right. Maybe that's what she did? Maybe she's taken them? Let's see. Nothing in here anymore? No? Okay. Can we go out to the balcony? Doesn't seem like it. Hmm. Okay. Got the sink, the oven's there. Yeah. All the, uh, all the other stuff's been taken away. Where's my stuff, then? What about this? Am I going to remove it? Yeah, why not? No more tools? No? Okay. Ah, hang on. What's this? Oh, it's a bullet train ticket. Yeah, I'm going to take it. Okay, good, good. Just need to find the other two. Somewhere around here? Okay. There's the smartphone. And then there was something else, right? Ah, there it is. The key. I got my house key. I'm sure nothing will be forgotten now. It's time to check out. Okay. Let's see. Oh. Who left this here? There's a message on a paper. You seem to have misunderstood something. I'll tell you what. It's true that Nina has been on my mind for a long, long time. But I stayed in this room because I really wanted to live together with a good-looking guy. When you showed up as the last resident in this room, I was disappointed from the bottom of my heart. After all, my dream didn't come true until the very end. Well, these seven days weren't so bad in their own way. As for Nina, I want to thank you again. Thank you for taking care of her to the end instead of me. She was very shy, and I thought she'd never miss anyone but me. But in the pictures, Nina seemed to be enjoying her new environment very much. I was a little surprised that she could get along with other cats. I guess she must have been very comfortable in your home. I was a little jealous, but I was relieved that Nina seemed happy. Thank you for making Nina happy. It's time for me to leave this room. I let my wild side out during your stay. It's been a while since I've had my favourite sweets. I got to see Nina in the picture again. And on top of that, I was able to enjoy my life with you, even if it was only for a little while. There's no reason for me to stay here any longer. Thank you for your seven-day business trip. Thank you for everything. Take care of yourself. Hmm. You too. Wow. There you go. From the heart there. So she did enjoy my company. I thought she did. Oh, that <laughs> your admiration for good-looking men is amazing, I say. <laughs> I think there are more important factors to consider when choosing a man than his face. Yeah? For example, the ability to stay calm even when there's a ghost next to him. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'm going to take that with me. You probably don't need it where you're going, do you? Okay. So, I guess this is goodbye, right? Are you going already? Okay, I guess so. Nice meeting you. Nice getting haunted by you. 
You're definitely one of the friendlier ghosts. Oh. Wait. Oh, what's this? I want you to have this. What, your fist? You gonna punch her? <laughs> what is it? Oh, right. And what is that, exactly? Oh, it's the tail hair that I got from Nina's corpse. Right. I always wondered about that. It did look a little bit weird. I want you to have it. I'll return Nina to you. I think she'd want that. Want to shake my hand? Oh. I, uh, 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 what? Is she in the suitcase now? Or is she, like, in inside me? What, the <laughs> what just happened there? It was like she was going to, you know, come in for a hug or something, and then... Well, I don't know. Maybe she's gone. Maybe she's gone, and, and maybe I'm going too. All right. Well, there you go. That was Seven Nights Ghost, everyone. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments, like or dislike the video. What did you think? I really enjoyed this, actually. I found it very unique, and I found it a very interesting take on, you know, being haunted by a ghost in a horror game. At times, it was spooky. At times, it was horrifying. At times, it did startle me and make me jump. But at others, it was heartwarming. Yeah, I enjoyed the story. I, I enjoyed the relationship that began strangely, but we got closer as it went on, and wait, hang on, hang on. Oh? Okay. It's not over quite yet. Ah. <laughs> I got myself a donut. And this time, she's not around to steal it. But, oh! Or is she? Is she sticking around? Okay. Did you get a ticket? <laughs> okay. <laughs> right, yeah, she doesn't really care about me, she just cares about the donuts. Oh, damn! Okay. Well, this is going to be the start of a very strange relationship, isn't it? <laughs> oh! Oh, and the cat's back as well? Nah, surely not. They're just... They're just visiting, right? You eat donuts very strangely. <laughs> but there you go, Seven Nights Ghost.
Now, it's come to my attention that there's actually two endings to the game, and I think it's got something to do with these things. So previously I've found them, I've burned them all, but this time I'm gonna leave this one on the door and see if it changes anything, okay? Maybe I can get another ending. Ah, it is different. So far the ending cutscene has been exactly the same until now, until after the credits. What's this? Oh, it's, it's the apartment, isn't it? Oh, I see, I'm playing as her. Well, this is... This is heaven, I assume. Right. Oh, and I'm not alone. <laughs> okay. All right, there you go. That was the second ending to Seven Nights Ghost. Was it better? Was it worse? It seems like we went our separate ways, but, well, leave your thoughts down below in the comments. Which do you prefer? Thanks for watching. See you next time. You will be the last resident here. Sounds ominous when you read that. Um... <laughs> uh... <laughs> I guess that's going to affect the ghost in some way. Cool. <laughs> okay. Hi. Okay. Cool. Holy shit. <laughs> Everyone laughed so hard when I replied, I was attacked and robbed of my donut. <laughs> I'd laugh too. In fact, I just did. That's one of the three. Wait, ooh, okay, she's back. <laughs> of course she is, I don't think she ever leaves. Okay. What's this? Toilet cleaner! Whoa, what? Okay, maybe I should have given her some privacy! I don't have a donut, maybe I should give that to her. Whoa! <laughs> Are you something I should be scared of? <laughs> yes, she looks extremely angry. The pudding I bought yesterday is gone. What, because the ghost ate it? There's only one person who could have done this. <laughs> right, okay. I, whoop. Wow, she was close. I won't let my modest enjoyment during the business trip be taken away any further. Uh. <laughs> She's got the donut. She saw, of course she saw. I always wanted to live with a good looking man. Oh. Right, and so your wish is coming true? Oh, by the way, you're not good looking. Oh, <laughs> Detergent. 
Oh, bloody hell. Okay, I'm getting out of this area. 20%. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Yeah, she's getting a little bit too close for comfort, honestly. I'm not concerned with her, you know, killing me or anything like that, but I do think if I'm caught, she is going to steal a donut. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. I was surprised to meet a roommate, but I've learned a lot about how to deal with her. <laughs> yeah, I suppose so. Would that go there? Oh no, that's there, isn't it? So it would get... Ah, yes, okay. We've we've located the keyhole. I, I guess. Uh... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That was close. That was really close. F, T, V, F. Square? Is that it? She's just going to want to jump you. Oh, and she did. That was almost a smile, wasn't it? I... <laughs> She's in a bad mood, evidently. Yeah. Ooh. Is she angry again? Oh, she's something. Nice meeting you. Nice getting haunted by you. <laughs> oh. Hey, that, that. What? Oh! Right, yeah, she doesn't really care about me. She just cares about the donuts. Oh, damn. Okay. Well, this is going to be the start of a very strange relationship, isn't it? <laughs>